Uh, so it's flare breath and satellite. Uh, flare breath and satellite. So I would have flare breath on. Satellite is like straight here, easy. See if we can just do this like quick. Get this out of the way. Yeah, that actually does help. Having like a slow moving ball. Ah, uh, Curry with the raid. Well, thank you very much, my dude. Yeah, I'll even do a quick pause here. Thank you very much, Kari, for the raid. And hello, all you awesome raiders. What were you doing today? Let me just go ahead and give you a nice shout out. Because uh, you're a very, very cool guy. Like, I've, I've, I've said this numerous times, but if, if nobody here has, or somebody here hasn't given a follow to good old British Viking Kari. Because number one, he's a Viking, which is sick. And he's a cool dude in general. So he's definitely earned it. Been a little bit here we go so what have you been playing my friendo what's been going on dead cells ah oh, it's such a good game ah oh, it's such a good game is dead cells I, I haven't played it but i've seen my girlfriend play it a little bit and ah oh, it's so good it's such a good game hey adam welcome to the stream friendo how are you doing today and welcome back to you too curry welcome back to the stream to you it's such a good game i really want to stream it sometime myself you're half trying to semi to convince Adam to get it. Adam, so I have not played the game myself yet, but well, you've seen Curry play it, but I have, like I said, have watched my girlfriend play it quite a bit. Uh, she, she hasn't played everything for me, but like she's, she's played some of the game and I've watched. She's played more than I've watched, but she, she I've watched some is what I'm trying to say. But anyway, it's a good game. Well worth the money. Highly recommend it. I'm with Kari on this one. I haven't even played the game. So that should say that should say something about that. What do I need to get for, for multi-flare? Need to get 50. Well, there's 60, so I think we're set. Uh, so if nobody if, if people aren't really too sure what I'm trying to be doing here uh, I am playing Final Fantasy 16. We're doing some story, but I'm also trying to get some of these trials done Because uh, they're pretty cool and they're pretty difficult So what am I at so I need to do one multi burst and a punish I should be able to get the punish in There we go. So I promise normally I pay a lot more attention to like the chat. It's just a bit harder to do when you're racing against the fuck while also trying to beat things that can absolutely murderize you. So if I seem a bit slow to respond at all, I apologize wholeheartedly. How am I doing on magic burst? Probably almost there. I know I've done at least five. Let me see. Okay, they're done. Okay, that's not the one I meant to do, but I mean, that will do. Unless I cancel it like, uh, like a dumb pass, that is. There we go, there we go, there we go. Getting him down. There we go, not, not bad. I think I did it quicker the first time, but that's okay. This one, this one's still gonna count. At least full try to semi-convince you're not gonna get them with a quarter of effort. 
Nice. But he was already considering it. Doesn't need full effort. Okay, good. Well, if he's already considering it, then that's that's really good because it's definitely something worth considering. I really need to play it. I really need to get around to playing it. I say that with so many games, though. And it's so true every single time I say it. I need to do it. I need to get around to it, etc., etc. Right, which one's this? Which one's this? So impulse and satellite again. Well, no, impulse is uh, slightly different. So let's get flare breath out of here. We'll find impulse. I know I have one for impulse. Do I actually? I think I do. Do I not have one for impulse? Is that why I ha is that why I wasn't putting them on? I did, I thought I had some. Did I not? I guess I don't have one for impulse. Huh. Interesting. So impulse and satellite. I guess yeah, yeah, because we can put on like flare breath damage. And flare breath, like cooldown time. Yeah, I think that's. I think that's why. I think that's why I did that. Okay, impulse. Gonna say, we just need to get to 60. Uh, I think. Oh, I didn't. I didn't do collateral impulse. Hold on, we'll fix that. Oh no, you need to strike them. That's right. Just like that, I think. Yeah. Not, wasn't it? How come I did it so so easily last time, but I, I I haven't done it this time like once. Okay, let's try this again. So did that count? No, it didn't count. Strike two enemies with a single impulse. So like that? Is that it? Okay, so that's it. Punish. Okay, we can punish you, Lightbound Wolf. Uh, now I need a multi-burst, a multi-flare, and a multi-charge. All of which I should be able to get done on him. Okay, hold up. Okay, yeah, that's good. So I need to get Mega Flare up to four. Okay, yeah, we almost have it. Yeah, okay, we're gonna have it regardless. Okay. So this needs to hit how many times? 150 into 50. Okay, I mean, that's easily doable. Oh, but wait, I'm actually killing him a bit too quick. Was that it? Did that get it? Ah, must have been. Ah, must have been just like a little bit off. Okay, that's fine. I can try to get that here instead. I can try. Man, I'm sucking for time now. Oh my god, I'm... Man, this was so easy the first time, and now I'm like, oh no, I'm actually, like, losing out on a lot of time. Hmm. I 
I try not spam, but I'm, I'm trying to be a bit safe here too. Okay, there we go. There we go. Now this should be a pretty easy 50. Yeah, there's the 40. I'm pretty sure we hit the 50. Well, we hit the 60, so we definitely hit the 50. Okay, so that's it. So now we can just win. It's a little, little bit unfortunate that I, I'm kind of sucking for time, but that is okay. As it will happen. If we, if we impulse, we should be fine. There you go. We're getting bonuses. Bonuses for days. Bonuses for days. We'll do this. Get back a little bit of health. And hopefully actually dodge. That would be nice, too. Okay, we're getting some health back at least. Okay, yeah, no, this is, this is going really well. This is going really well. Okay, I did that by accident. It's okay, we can just cancel it. Ooh, okay, not ideal. Not ideal. I mean, still stage two done, but I mean, it's not. Well, we're up to two minutes, actually. That's fine. Okay, we're, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. it health is going to be the big one, I think. Health is going to be the big issue. You got this? Well, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate the support. Uh, okay, so stage three, I don't remember being that difficult. So I think, we, yeah, we got Impulse and Giga Flare. I don't think I have one for either, though. So that's actually okay. Um, Like, uh, items, I mean. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. Okay, no, 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 no. We need we need to deal with the little shits first. Okay, little shits officially dealt with. Mmm. This is so bad. What am I even doing? I can't go on. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I, I I didn't believe in that one anyway. We'll try it one more time. We'll try it one more time. I didn't believe in that run. That run, I lost faith. I lost faith early. Okay, so flare breath and saddle, but but legitimately though, this one actually seems pretty pretty all right. <sighs> Like, not incredibly easy to do, but, like, easier than than the wind one that we did. Okay. Pop it. So we're going to let this run, run through for the 50. So we're at 20. 40. We're probably at 50, 60, okay. 
So that's that done. So that's the, the main the main two really. Okay, I think that's full flare. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Can't forget punish. What's the other one that I need to do? Satellite? I mean, satellite I can do on the last dude. Now, granted, all these I can do on the last dude. But if I can work on multiburst, that'd also be great. Eh, just punish. Okay, that, that, that's fine, that's fine. Um, actually, give me satellite. Satellite, I think I just need to hit like what? 50? 60? Yeah, 60. How am I doing on multi burst? Got everything. Alright, we're good. We're good. You know what? Yeah, we'll, we'll just do that. Kill him faster, get some health back. Do this all from a safe distance. Eh, arguably, got health back. I think I got some. Either way. We're doing good. We're doing good. I think about 130 is what I had last time. Once again, doesn't really matter. No, I have one for satellite, don't I? I, I, can't, I can't remember. Do I have one for satellite? Or is it only Flare Breath? I do have one for Satellite. I don't think that did. No, it didn't. Do you gotta strike them? Strike two enemies with a single impulse. Oh, oh wait, no, I, I get what it means. I get what it means. Okay, well, we'll just do this one first. Partly because this one's actually kind of cooperating. Kind of. Kind of. Oh my god. Please stop. Okay, good. Good. So that's that's what it needs so it just needs that so that's actually really easy to do then
Okay, so I just need punish and magic burst. It's fine. That is fine for both. I don't even know what I'm on for magic burst. Okay, well, that's it for the magic burst. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me lock onto you. I am a little bit worried about my HP, but... I think I can manage this. Divine hammer. It's fine. Damn it. I don't even really know what I dodged there, if I'm being honest. E, e. Yeah, this isn't too great. Yeah, I had it so good on the first run, and now I'm just absolutely blowing it. I mean, this is fine. This is fine. Even if I got to play just a tiny bit safer, even if I got to do that, that's fine. Like that'll help. I got greedy. I got greedy. I was like, I can kill him. I can, and then I got greedy. Ugh. No, see, this one I can. Ah, oh, this one I can do though. This one I can. This one I'm gonna keep at until I actually do, because this one I know isn't really that bad. Especially now that I know how collateral, uh, how the collateral thing works. Okay, satellite and flare breath. That's all I need. We'll get back to the story soon, I promise. That yeah, was a bit strange. So you can so farm it on those. Okay, just let it hit 50 or 60. There we go. This is going swimmingly. So, truth be told, I might actually mispunish. Oh no, I'm not gonna mispunish. So I can just punish you, light bound bug. Did I get the other ones? I haven't gotten Satellite or Multiburst. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine.
Did I do... So I've done all of them. So now, now we're just in the clear. See, that was a much better stage one. We even got the final parry in. A much, much better stage one. Okay, all right. Not bad, not bad. 235, 235, we're doing really well on time. See, now this is the stubborn side of me when that comes out. When I know I can do something, but I just haven't done it yet. I keep slamming my head on it. It always works. Well, maybe not always. It mostly works. Satellite impulse. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Okay, we almost have it. We almost have it. Yeah, Mega Flare. All right, cool, cool. Okay, I'm at, I'm at 40. Okay, I should, I should hit the 60 here. Okay, so we got the 60. Damn it, I was going I was going a bit bit too hard on the dodging. Alright, is this fine? Is this fine? Let's keep trying to do magic first when we can. Try and weave them in. Feel like it's a bit hard to do while well. limit breaking though. Okay, what are we at? Multi burst. So uh, just multi burst punish and oh, I thought I did the collateral impulse. Okay, well, I don't want you threshing. So which one? Punish. This is like the last thing I can punish. There we go. Okay, so I thought I... Did I okay, did that one work? Okay, that, that one works, sure. Why not? Maybe I don't understand Collateral Impulse still. Maybe I only thought I did. Okay, try to focus on both of them a little bit. Maybe try to focus one. Maybe focusing one is better. Okay, yeah, so we're, we're all good. We're all good. I guess, I, you know what, actually, I guess I can punish the vultures. I guess that's true. Never really thought of that as an option. No, don't focus on the vultures, focus on the man. Focus on the mans. You get so much LB back too from Impulse. It's actually pretty insane. Okay, 
blew that one a little bit. Okay, well, at least we got past it. At least we got past it. And we got four minutes, so we can play. We can play, right? Like, we can play around in stage three if we get spooked. Which I know there's one thing that'll spook me here. Okay, so it doesn't really matter what I take. Whoops. Then why'd I do that, right? Okay, hold up, hold up. Realization hits. I do need to collateral Giga Flare, which I probably should have done there, but that's fine. Oh, come on. That should have been a dodge. Okay, that is actually really good. Now, did I... I didn't... Okay, so I... T shit, I should have let the multi-flare go. Ugh, I should have let the multi-flare go. What am I doing? I don't think it matters a ton. Like, truth be told, I don't think it really matters that much. I mean, whether or not I do the collateral, like, a Giga Flare, I don't, I don't think it matters. As long as I'm over, like, three minutes, I think. Which I should be. Because I should be able to do multi-burst. I can probably do the... Oh, no, I can still do the collateral Giga Flare. I just need to be incredibly careful. And I need to line these two up. And then not be dumb. Oh my God, I'm, oh my God, I'm being dumb. Oh my god, I, that would have been like perfect. Okay, this is still fine. That's not collateral, is it? Nah, it isn't. was not okay well it should still be fine I get to just be a little bit more spooked
Mm, yeah, nah, this is, this is gonna be okay. We'll make it to the boss. It's just past that. I'm, I'm concerned. We do have over three minutes. Uh, it's gonna be okay. I, I I swear I'm not just saying that to to make myself feel better. I I think three minutes is more than I, what I need for the final final stage. Health is gonna be my big concern. Health is probably gonna be my biggest concern. Okay, so on Flare Breath and Giga Flare. So we'll just really beef up Flare Breath. Get rid of satellite stuff. Mm, okay. All right. See, it's not a good start. Mm. My God, I I didn't even like get a proper shot at that. Ah, oh, I didn't even get a proper shot. Ah, oh, it's gonna be what bothers me the most. Oh. Oh, I know I can do it. I know this. Oh. We'll do some story. We'll do some story. We'll we'll make some story progress because maybe I can get like. See, it's not so much the weapons, though, is is the thing, right? It's just, like... Because I'm thinking, maybe I can get a, a couple levels. Maybe I can get, like... A few, um... A few, like, upgrades. Like, maybe some weapons or something. Maybe some health. If I could get some health upgrades, actually, that would be good. So, we'll, we'll do some servers, and we'll, we'll come back near the end of the stream. This charmer ain't letting anyone through. Why are the gates closed? Because I can do it. I will do it. No one's allowed in without his say so. Before the streams end, I will do it. Anyway. You look like trouble. I suggest you go home. That's what I'm trying to do, you little prick. Oh, it's true. This is Black Lauren's home. Just a bit, have you, Snotty? No. It isn't. Blackthorn. Long time no see, eh? What the hell are you doing here? Well, it was meant to be a surprise, but since you are so nicely, I'm here to see Zoltan, you fucking numbskull. Now let us through. All right. He's like, okay, Blackthorn. I'm Just sorry. Don't go starting anything with the chief. I mean, does Blackthorn look like the kind of guy that would start something? Punch. That good enough for you? So the door is finally open. See, I was kind of wondering when they opened this. I didn't think they do it in a, in, in like a, a side quest though. That's interesting. Oh, here it is. Yeah, nice little town. I don't know if I'd live here, mind you, but it's also because I don't think I'd like living in a desert. Not much going on, is there? It's a smithing town. When I was a lad, you'd have to shout to be heard over the sound of hammer on anvil. Clive, you're good with people. You speak to Sultan. Yeah, I'll do my best. Hey, you ain't backing out now, are you? There's a river of bad blood between me and the chief. 
someone can build me a bridge, then I'll cross it. All right. Hey, Rossfield. Welcome I'll back to the stream, Frendo. How you doing today? I appreciate it. It'll be near the forge on the hill. It was our master's. He'd have inherited it when I left. The forge on the hill. So I just letting the cutscene play out first. You'll be needing it. Man, yeah, welcome back to stream, Frendo. Oi, oi, Clive, my boy. Doing good? That's good. I'm glad to hear that. Uh, things have been good for me. Thank you very much. Was struggling with one of the uh, the challenges, one of the trials. So I figured just do some story and maybe get some better equipment first. Then maybe go back and have a shot at it. Uh, besides that, yeah, doing doing good. A, a little bit warm, oddly enough. A little bit, a little bit on the warm side, which kind of surprises me, considering I don't think it's all that cold out or all that warm out. But would you like to see my wares? You never know. Yeah, I'll Thank buy that. You. Is that all you has? Yeah, I'll go ahead and I'll, I'll buy me a couple of these as well. May as well. Certainly. Here you are. Uh, yeah, all right. Hey, we meet again. I'm working my way through FF10 and Jekt is the twat. Dude, FF10 is really good. FF10 is one of my favorite, uh, favorite Final Fantasies. So is this your first time playing through it? If if it is, then man, I you're gonna have to tell me what you think of it uh, as you as you play it, because it looks like it's one of my favorites. Okay, let's have a bit of an explore around town real quick. Written, the man who closed the doors on his great grandfather's forge. Mm. Oh, don't say that. It's not over yet. Okay, so it's it, it, town's doing a bit rough. I see. Jekt is a really interesting character in 10. I will say that. He's really interesting. Nope, we've been through F10 more than 40 times growing up. You just never streamed it before, so you thought you'd be like, oh, dude, hell yeah. That sounds pretty, pretty good. Well, yeah, as a fellow, like, like I said, I'm a big fan of 10. I absolutely love FF10. And it's going to be nice to, to play through it. Like, I don't think I'd stream it, but I do want to make some sort of content out of it. Never in all my long years have things been as bad as they are. And I really, really am looking forward to that. It's so good. Hey, welcome back, Bass. Chief doesn't seem to think so. Let's not give up hope just yet, eh? It's one of your favorites? You have good taste. You have really, really good taste. Ah, oh, thank Sorry. you very much for the follow, friendo. Always appreciated. Yeah, so one thing that I wanted to do this year that I just never had the chance to get around to doing was uh, a playthrough of actually every Final Fantasy game. Every single one of them. Or, or at least, like, the, the numbered ones plus sequels, I guess. I, I don't know if I'd do, like, Crystal Chronicles. I might. Um, but I want to play through the Final Fantasy games, like, through the series... Um, that probably will be on the YouTube channel, mind you. That probably won't be on the streams. Because you, you guys have seen how much time I spent on 16 here. Right? Uh, so it's probably not very feasible for... Unless I want to spend the next, like, five years of my life dedicated to streaming Final Fantasy. Uh, probably going to be a YouTube exclusive uh, series. But I'm really looking forward to that. And you know what I found out? Final Fantasy 1. Not actually that expensive if I wanted to buy it on original hardware. <laughs> Should have done this earlier. Thank you for the posture check and the hydrate, by the way. You stream 1 to 6, 10, 15, and 16. Very nice. You have to give me some more water here soon. Even all the bravest. Bravest, huh? There's some spin up stuff we're trying to. I'm sure I'll try some of them. Good stuff. Um, like, I'm sure I'll try some. I don't know. I'll, I'll probably get a list, and I'll probably go down a list. By the end of it, I'll probably play through all of them, even the spinoffs. Probably. Um, but yeah, that's one thing that I really, really want to do. Because out of all the Final Fantasy games, I've only played 16 now while playing through first time. Currently playing through 16. Um, 14 and 7 for sure and 10 as we've talked about 10-2 as well 
and a little bit of eight, but I never actually finished eight. I don't know why. I don't think, I, don't, I think at the time I couldn't get into it quite as much. So I really want to play through all the rest of them. flames wouldn't melt butter, let alone iron. Pardon the intrusion. I'm looking for the chief. That's you, isn't it? That'd be me. I was gonna say I could tell by your receding hairline. Nice you. I'll bet it is. Keep the gates closed, I tell him. Well done, snotty. You're not welcome here. Get out before things turn nasty. Blackthorn's here. What did you say? He's traveled a long way to see you. Yes, has he? Mm. He's waiting. Down by the gates. Then I suggest you take him with you when you leave. No, I think we're gonna Didn't stay. We do apprentice together. So what if we did? Fuck! We're getting nowhere. These bearers' flames are next to bloody useless. We're never gonna be able to fire up the forges unless we can find some new crystals. I'm at this mm. as you can see, so do me a favor and piss off. Oh, and if you're struggling to find your way out, ask Blackthorn. Okay, that, that yeah. prick knows exactly where the exit is. Man, you seem like an I'm asshole. Not here. And neither are you. All right, I'm going. Time to burn down the village. This isn't the start of an RPG adventure, but maybe we can be the start of someone else's RPG adventure. I'm sure someone in here would try to get revenge if I burned down this village. Mama, why hasn't Papa come back yet? He's helping the chief with something very important. You go back inside now. Mm. Hey, Cooney, welcome back to the stream. Friendo, how are you doing today? Uh, he needs some of Clive's hair. He does. Clive has, like, an abundance of hair. Let me transplant some of that under Zoltan. It is the one with the gun blades. It is. That is the one with the gun blades. I don't know. I, I just... I don't know. I couldn't get into 8. I don't know what it was. I do know of the plot to 8. I'm not going to go ahead and say, like, 8 is completely blind. I did watch uh, the Spoony one way back in the day do his big-ass review on Final Fantasy 8. So I do know of the plot to 8. I don't remember a ton, mind you, but I, I know roughly the plot and everything. But I don't remember everything beat for beat. Clive, you have a sword, mate. Use it. That is how protagonists get made, for sure. Let me guess. Zoltan told you to piss off. Yeah, he did. How'd you know? Personal favor to him, yes. Hmm. Well, at least he didn't beat about the bush. Yeah, it's true, I guess. Him around. Not after what I did. Okay, Just what happened? Exactly. Tell, tell us, Blackthorn. What, what happened? Help, we need to know. What turned the village against you? I left. Ravoged. Zoltan. The burden of leadership our dying master dropped in our laps. Hmm. All of it. There are two kinds of smiths in this world, you see. My kind, who are in it for the love of the craft. We will labor on a single piece from dawn to dusk to get it just right. Mm. And the other kind who are in it for different reasons. People like Zoltan, whose work is quick and cheap. The kind of smiths who shit out a few hundred blades, reap the profit, and divvy out among themselves. There wasn't a single day we weren't each other's throats. And bit by bit, people started taking sides. You would have torn Dravos in half had it gone on. So, I left. You didn't have to do that. Zoltan's a better chief than I would have been. His way of doing things kept food on people's tables. The Ravosh prospered without me and my lofty ideals getting in the road. Until the crystals mm. run out at any rate. Without magic to fire the furnaces. Yeah, I guess that would be kind of a problem for a smithing town, huh? As good as dead. It depends on how you look at it, though. There's got to be other ways of making fire. We manage it in the Deadlands. I mean, Thanks to that's true. Dewey, yeah. He saw all of this coming. New crystals were the problem, not the solution. And spent years coming up with ways of doing without. You know mm. what I mean, though, right? Where there's a will, there's a way. Yeah. What I'm trying to say is that it's not your fault. You couldn't have predicted this. It doesn't matter whose fault it is. I don't want to be the greatest mm. smith alive just because I happen to be the last. 
Yeah, I wonder if these guys would have like the basic understanding of fire making. Wrong with those furnaces. So, do you think it's time we shared Sid's bellows with the world? The way I see it, it's your decision. Yeah, to I make. never, I never really thought about that. Phone. You know, Sid made those things for us. They give us an edge like, on the rest. Like, if if everybody you here is so away. used to using crystals, they probably wouldn't know how to make a proper fire without All them, right. would they? Do it. This place was your home. I won't abandon it to its fate. It's kind of interesting to think about. Its creations were never meant it's good to be world building, it. actually. It was only ever a matter of time before we shared them. Let this be another step on the road to freeing Valisthea from the prison of the crystal's blessing. Dravosht will show the world that it's possible. Wouldn't you agree, August? When you put it that way. I mean, that is true. Of course. Like hearing Sid speak from beyond the grave. <laughs> Thank you, Clive. Shall I go and fetch the plans then? I know I'm off by heart. I'll be needing some help though. Building a furnace isn't exactly a one-man job. Nah, I can help with that easy. Round up anyone strong enough to lug a brick or two. Here we are. It sounds good. Uh, all right then. And I've got a job for you too, Clive. Finding me some salamander skin. I need leather for the bellows and nothing else will withstand the heat. Luckily for us, salamanders feed out in the fields of Carava. Time for a spot of hunting, then. Let's see, let's see. A friend of mine is not a fan of 13, and I think they showed me his review of it. Also, I feel bad for what happened there. Yeah, I think, um, I think he did do one of 13. I never watched that one. Oh, wait, wait. Is it is it like his vlog review? I think he did do a vlog review of it. I think I did watch that one, but I don't remember anything about it. Um, he did one on ten, but I don't think I ever watched that one. I, I kind of started falling out of Spoony stuff. Let's go. Um, I think when he released that, which kind of sucks. Now he's like stopped doing it. I've gotten like back into it. But who knows, maybe the Spoonie comeback will actually happen, and maybe, maybe I can watch his content again. Alright, so we need to kill some kind of salamander, and I That's feel like one has been we? here. Yeah, all right. Well, you're more than just a salamander. You're kind of a big, big-ass wyvern. At least need to upgrade impulse. At least. I hit him with you. Hit him with you. Hit him with you. Hit him with you and you. And finally, we finish it off. Probably a bit of overkill with a little bit of schma. And he's going to do it again. But he, yeah, that's a cool end screen, actually. Uh, with Spoonie, you heard something happened with Spoonie and you hope he's okay. Spoonie had a lot of issues. Uh, I don't know if I've talked about it much on stream. I think I might have a little bit during the, the, um, the Phantasmagoria stream, which I still actually need to finish. It's been almost a year since I started that. Whoops. Uh, the gist of what happened to Spoonies, he just kind of fell off the deep end. Um, uh, some of it had to do with, I, I think after his girlfriend left him, uh, he started getting more into alcohol, which I think led to a bit of a downfall. He stopped creating content and he just kind of disappeared, but like he was still doing fine-ish. Well, he wasn't doing fine, but like he was still alive and doing living, I guess. Uh, he got another girlfriend. 
who I guess that's how he was kind of living. I guess she was the one making the money. Um, and then she left him and he kind of spiraled. I think his house got foreclosed on. And I think last I heard he moved in with his brother. And then he's doing better now from what I understand, though. I know he's playing. He's been playing games with um the Phantasmagoria guys. What, shoot. What are what are they called? It's um. It's it's always there, but like I can never remember it when I need to. Um, Curtis Craig. It's like the, the Curtis Craig YouTube channel. Uh, I'm pretty sure he, he's been playing video games with the guy that runs that, whose name I also always forget, but I I, I should know it because I, I always know what it is until I need to say it. Um, Like Paul, I think. Shoot. Hold on. Hold on. But like he's been playing stuff there, which is really good, like really, really good for Spoonie. And he actually made a cameo in, yeah, Paul Morgan Stetler. That's it. Yeah. And he actually made a cameo in, in someone's video recently where he has like a setup, like he has a, his chair and he has like his posters on his wall. And he looks like he's going to get back into making videos, which I'm I'm really happy about. So he was doing a lot of really bad stuff. Or he had a lot of really bad stuff happen, but he's getting better. Yeah, it seems like, funnily enough, thanks to Paul Morgan Stetler and um, his other friend, whose name I can't remember, um, Dave, I think. Uh, so thanks to those two, it seems like Spoonie's kind of actually kind of having a bit of a renaissance, at least for himself. Even if he never gets back into making videos, I'm at least happy that he's doing well. But I do want him to get back to making videos because they were always really, really good. And I feel like we kind of need more of the spoony content creator that type. Enough for a decent set of bellows. Like in, in today's era of YouTube. Ready go? Yeah. And I'm not just talking like the angry video game kind of reviewer either. I don't think we really need more of those necessarily, but he was he just that usually had a lot of good insight from what I remember. So I really hope he makes a comeback. I actually kind of talked uh, talked with Megan about this during a recording that we did recently, funnily enough, where I'm kind of a bit upset at his fan base because his fan base was always like kind of a bit nasty towards him, at, at least on his subreddit, which to an extent I can kind of understand because he wasn't creating content yet. He was still like kind of e-begging as it were without really doing much um during his really dark period but like now that he's getting better you still have people on his subreddit bitching like in one thing that he did i think on the curtis craig you you twitch uh, i think he was like showing like a gray beard like he has like a gray beard and i think his hair is starting to kind of gray a little bit and someone in the on the reddit was like man look at this guy look look at him he looks so bad it's like he's just graying up. He doesn't look bad at all. He looks really good, actually. He looks better than what he did. You just can't please some people. You really just can't please some people. You know, and it's really sad because Spoonie's just a dude. See, this is kind of the other thing. This kind of goes back. This kind of like wraps around back to like what we were talking about earlier. Right? Uh, like, because Spoonie is legitimately like just a guy. Right? He's just a dude. But yet, people are more than happy to just kind of like treat him like like he's like the worst human being imaginable. When you know, say what you want about him, when he was like in his really dark time where he was kind of e begging and not doing much and always like whining on Twitter. But like now he's doing better. Like I mean, you know, give the guy some credit. <laughs> right give the man a bit of credit he's doing better than a lot of people that went down his path 
you know like so many people fall to alcohol and they don't they don't come back he's kind of coming back so and he has he had like a lot of mental health issues too i think was one of the other things i think he had like a lot of a lot of mental health issues um but he seems like he's getting better and man give him praise please you know like legitimately if if you guys can i recommend going and looking up the spoony one on youtube i don't know if he i don't know how easy it is to find his videos anymore to be honest i think a lot of them kind of came down i think he's recently been re-uploading some of the old ones so find the spoony one on youtube or find like noah antweiler it might also be his his youtube channel name and like watch his videos like take a like go back to the past from when like i was growing up on on the internet and see what videos i used to watch because they they he's really good he is legitimately funny he, he was probably the best um the best angry reviewer from back in the day right because he was actually really good and really funny like it was back during that era it was the angry video game nerd that i would watch and spoonie those are the two main ones i watched i also watched some r make 21 may he rest in peace but I, I mostly watched Spoonie and the AVGN. Right? So, go give him a watch, please. A lot of his stuff's really good. You can watch his playthrough of Phantasmagoria 2, even though I'm hoping to actually play through Phantasmagoria 2 sometime in the hopefully near future, actually. Uh, you can go watch it. Like, legitimately, I could not be better than his. His is really, really good. Um watch his like bayou billy review that one's really funny you, if you want you can watch his review on ff8 like that's really funny his ultima review series is really good as well like he's really good like please like watch him like watch him like just do it he, he's so good and give the man your support like tell him he's doing a good job because he legitimately is